I'm gonna show you an amazing and free AI image processing tool for creating Google post images, Google products images, basically any images that you use in your digital marketing work. We create a lot of Google posts and Google product images for our clients at WhiteSpark, but getting them to give us good photos can be like pulling teeth. Oh, no. We ask them, no, we beg them to send us photos of them on the job, meeting with customers, doing the work, whatever it is. And I bet a lot of the SEOs out there understand this pain. The client finally sends you an image and it looks like this. We found that the perfect dimensions for Google Posts and Google Products is 1200 by 900. That's typically what we use. And so when we get a photo like this, it's in the wrong aspect ratio and it's really hard to work with to kind of get that into our Google Post format. Well, let me introduce you to your new best friend, ClipDrop. This free tool has a ton of really great things you can do with photo image processing. You can uh, upscale, you can remove backgrounds, you can adjust the lighting, replace backgrounds, really powerful stuff. So if I'm trying to make a nice new Google post or Google product image, and I get something like that that I have to work with, this tool comes in super handy. Now, I wish the client had sent me a uh, larger photo, but this is what I got. So I'm gonna start by using the image upscale tool. Just drag in the photo and it actually upscales your image two times and it looks great. So this is my original photo here and ClipDrop made it twice as big and it still looks great. Now another problem we're gonna have with this photo is that the dimensions are all wrong for a Google Post or Google products. So here I'm gonna use their incredible uncrop feature. This is similar to Photoshop's generative fill, but this is free. So I'm just gonna drag in my upscaled photo and you'll see actually that the dimensions of clip drop with the free version, the max you can go for width is 1024, but 1024 by 768 is actually the same aspect ratio as our 1200 by 900. So I'm just gonna adjust the dimensions, get this in the middle, click next, and it works some AI magic to generate the rest of the picture. It just fills it in. Check it out. Now you're gonna get a number of different options and some of them are good, but some of them are not so good. This one here looks like, you know, someone's overlooking the job. Another one with an onlooker and just some weird stuff over here. I don't know about that. And check out this one. I don't know what the deal is here, but I think this guy might be licking the wall. <laughs> so not all of them are gonna be good. So here we go, I found a pretty good one. This will work just fine. And you can see that it kind of looks like the workspace and the AI just filled in the gaps, just decided, you know, well, let's just fill it in with this stuff. Totally works. I can now use this for my Google post. I have an image that is the right dimensions for generating a great Google post image. And did you know that most people are doing Google posts totally wrong? They think of Google posts like social media, but it totally is not social media. Check out this video next to learn how to do Google Posts the right way and see a number of really great examples of awesome Google Posts. And like and subscribe for more local SEO content.